Welcome back to Kaya. Let's explore. This is the greenhouse, where we grow vegetables and other plants. Nobody's in there now. Hey there, Molly. How's it going? Hey, Trini. If you want, we can grow giant vegetables in my garden. Hi, Mal. Hi, Mom. I'd love some more agate stones. Can you find any more at the river? Yeah, I'm on it. Masi, ciao. Thanks, Molly. Hi, Molly. Hi, Dad. Can you pick me some fresh blueberries so I can make some more blueberry jam? I'd love to help. Anabasi, thanks, Molly. How's it going, Molly? Hi, Auntie Midge. More people are asking for my famous syrup. Can you collect more sap for me? Sure thing. Mustn't cho. Thanks, Molly. Collect agate stones for Mom. Pick blueberries for Dad. Collect birch tree sap for Auntie Midge. Let's collect some agate stones to bring to Mom. All done! Here in Alaska, we only take what we need. And we've got five beautiful agate stones. Let's bring the agate stones to Mom. I'll add them to my backpack. Let's pick blueberries so Dad can make blueberry jam. All done! Here in Alaska, we only take what we need, and we've got a full basket. Let's bring the blueberries to Dad. I'll add them to my backpack. Let's collect sap to bring to Auntie Midge so she can make her syrup. First, throw a hole in the tree. Next, put the spile, a small tube, into the tree. This is how the sap will flow out. Then, pound the spile in to get it just deep enough to stay in place. Now, hang the bucket to collect the sap. All done! Here in Alaska, we only take what we need, and we've got a full bucket. Midge. I'll add it to my backpack. Deliver the agate stones to Mom. Deliver the blueberries to Dad. Deliver the sap to Auntie Midge. This is the spooky house. It doesn't look like anyone's in there. Spooky! How's it going, Mal? Hi, Mom. Did you find any agate stones? Yep, they're in my backpack. Let's get them from my backpack. Wow, thanks for the agates, Molly. I'll polish these up so we can sell them at the trading post. How's it going, Molly? Hi, Dad. Did you find any blueberries? Yep, they're in my backpack. Let's get them from my backpack. Anabasi, thanks for the blueberries, Mal. Now I can make blueberry jam. How's it going, Molly? Hi, Auntie Midge. Did you find any sap for me? Yep, it's in my backpack. Let's get it from my backpack. Thanks, Molly. This sap will make delicious syrup we can have with pancakes.
Molly. How's it going? Hey, Trini. That snowball fight was fun. Want to have another? Meet me and Tui at the snow fort. Totally. Snowball fights are so much fun. Want to have another snowball fight? Meet me and Trini at the snow fort. That sounds awesome. See you there. What can you find at the lake? Tap the arrows to explore. Ooh, a fox. Look at those caribou. Aw, snow hares. Cool, an owl. What can you find at the river? Tap the arrows to explore. Cool, an owl. That's a big salmon. You spotted a din chick, a moose. Ooh, a fox. <coughs> Do you want some treats, Suki? I have some in my backpack. <coughs> Let's get them from my backpack. Throw the treats to Suki. That's enough treats for Suki. Hi there, Molly. I'm going on an expedition, and I may need your help while I'm there. Can you visit Tui at his dog kennel to get ready for a sledding mission? I'm always up for a sledding mission. Masicho. Thanks, Molly. I love sharing this tradition with you, Molly. Let's make some music. Have a snowball fight. Tap to throw snowballs at Trini and Tui. And watch out. <laughs> Ha <laughs> 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 
Where Connie lives. Connie's great at building and fixing things. It doesn't look like she's home, though. Looks like the library is closed right now. Tap the basketball to shoot it into the hoop. Woohoo! Great job! Awesome! Woohoo! Yeah! Awesome! Great job! Great job! Woohoo! Awesome! Yeah! Woohoo! Great job! Yeah! Great job! Awesome! Woohoo! Great job! Awesome! Great job! Woohoo! 
Great job! Awesome! Woohoo! Yeah! Great job! Awesome! Yeah! Great job! Hey, Tui! Sled Dog Dash! Choose a sledding mission. Snowy Forest! Hi, everyone! It's me, Molly! And I'm Tui! Grandpa Nat needs our help! He's exploring in the forest, and he needs his field notebook. We can take my dogs on a sledding mission. Let's go. Our mission. Deliver the notebook to Grandpa Nat. We need five dogs to pull our sled. Tap the dogs in their houses to pick them. <coughs> Rascal. <coughs> Kobe. Luca! <coughs> Kiwi! <coughs> Sasha! Here's our dog team! Ready to go! Help me finish packing the gear we'll need for the trip. Put everything into the box. Cooking pot, leggings, dog boots, a notebook to deliver to Grandpa. Everything's packed. And I have my Sled Advisor app on my phone to help us. Let's get started on our sledding adventure. Three, two, one, go! Here we go! You can sear the sled around the obstacles like dirt patches and rocks. Oops! Stay away from the obstacles! Get the treats and toys for a speed boost. Woohoo! Extra speed! Wow! Look at us go! Awesome! We made it to the first checkpoint. Let's see how the dogs are doing. Our dogs are thirsty after running so far. Learn about how to take care of dogs when they're thirsty. Let's check our app to find out what to do. Tap on the part of the app that tells where you can learn how to take care of dogs when they're thirsty. Dog care. Dog gear. Sled. Dog care. That's right! You can learn about it in the dog care part of the app. Tap on the part of the app that tells where you can learn how to take care of dogs when they're thirsty. Hungry sled dogs. Thirsty sled dogs. Rest. Grooming. Thirsty sled dogs. That's right! You can learn about it in the thirsty sled dogs part of the app. 
should we use to help us get water for the dogs? Thirsty sled dogs. Sled dogs need a lot of water to stay healthy, one and a half gallons a day. Water is heavy to carry, so when people are traveling far, they melt snow into water by heating it. Heating snow in a cooking pot melts the snow into water. What should we use to help us get water for the dogs? Cooking pot. Dog boots. Meat. Cooking pot. That's right. That's what the caption says. Splash the water to let the dogs know they can drink. Good job. Let's get back to the sled. We're one step closer to getting the notebook to Grandpa. Three, two, one, go! The dogs had enough water to keep going the whole time. It's going to snow and get cold. Learn about the gear sled dogs need to wear in cold weather. Let's check our app to find out what to do. Tap on the part of the app that tells where you can learn about gear dogs need to wear in cold weather. Dog care. Dog gear. Sled. Dog gear. That's right! You can learn about it in the dog gear part of the app. Tap on the part of the app that tells where you can learn about gear dogs need to wear in cold weather. Cold weather gear. Warm weather gear. Night gear. Sled gear. Cold weather gear. That's right! You can learn about it in the cold weather gear part of the app. What should we use to help us protect dogs' feet from the snow? Cold weather gear. Black jackets. Black jackets keep dogs' bellies warm in cold weather. Dog boots. Dog boots protect dogs' feet from snow and water. Leggings. Leggings keep dogs' legs warm when it is windy. What should we use to help us protect dogs' feet from the snow? Leggings. Cooking pot. Dog boots. Dog boots. That's right. That's what the diagram says. Tap to put the boots on the dog. Good job. Let's get back to the sled. We're getting closer. Time for more sledding. Three... Two, one, go! protected the dog's feet in the snow. It's time for a break now, but we need to hold our sled in one place so our dogs don't get loose. Let's learn what part of the sled will keep it in place. Let's check our app to find out what to do. Tap on the part of the app that tells where you can learn about the part of the sled that keeps it in place. Dog care. Dog gear. Sled. Sled. That's right! 
You can learn about it in the sled part of the app. Tap on the part of the app that tells where you can learn about the part of the sled that keeps it in place. Parts of a sled. Sled gear. Sled speed. Parts of a sled. That's right. You can learn about it in the parts of a sled part of the app. What part of the sled will keep it in place? Parts of a sled. Snow hook. A snow hook sticks into the snow to keep the sled and dogs in place. Brush bow. A brush bow protects the sled in case it bumps into snow and bushes. Runners. Runners make the sled move smoothly over snow. What part of the sled will keep it in place? Brush bow. Fish. Snow hook. Snow hook. That's right. That's what the diagram says. Tap to stick the snow hook into the ground. Good job. Let's get back to the sled. This is our last sled run before we get to Grandpa. Three, two, one, go! Here's your notebook. Now I can write down my observations. Masi cho, Molly. That was a great help. I couldn't have done it without help from my friends. Choose your next sledding mission. Beating art. Hi, I'm Molly, and my mom is helping me learn how to bead. Beading is an important part of our culture. These are all my beading design cards. Design cards teach people how to make new things. Choose one of Molly's designs or make your own. Here are all my beading designs. My family and friends gave me many of these. Pick the design you'd like to make. Mountain flower. Butterfly. Wolf paw print. Leaves. Suki. Here's the design card you picked. Suki. Adorable. The card tells us the title of the design and a description. It also has the list of materials and the steps for beating our design. This design has seven steps. Let's get started. We should make sure we have everything we need. Read the materials list and tap all the items we'll be using. Materials. Pencil. Cloth. Bead box. Needles. Thread. Tap everything we need. Clothespin. That's not on our list. Let's check the list again. Tape. That's not on our list. Let's check the list again. Pencil. That's on our list. Cloth. That's on our list. Bead box. That's on our list. Needles. That's on our list. Red. Great job. You looked at the list of materials and picked everything we need. Now let's read the steps we need to follow. Step 1. Trace the shape with the pencil. Tracing the shape tells us what the design looks like. Tap to trace the shape.
Looks good. Step 2. Choose the gray beads. That's right. That's the color we need for this step. Let's go to the next step. Step 3. Stitch the gray beads until you're done. Step 4. Choose the white beads. That's right! That's the color we need for this step. Let's go to the next step. Step 5. Stitch the white beads until you're done. Step 6. Choose the black beads. That's right! That's the color we need for this step. Let's go to the next step. Step 7. Stitch the black beads until you're done. Quincy, this design looks amazing. I think it would make a great gift. Pick something to put our design on. Truncha! Looks great! This will be a nice gift for one of my friends in Kaya. Choose one of Molly's designs or make your own. I can't wait to give this present to my friend Trini. She'll love what I beaded it for her. I'll add it to my backpack. Deliver the present to Trini. Hey there, Molly. How's it going? Hey, Trini. I beaded something special just for you. It's in my backpack. Let's get it from my backpack. Wow, that's so nice of you. Thanks, Molly. This is where my friend Trini lives. Let's see if she's nearby. Hi, Molly! Hey, Trini! That snowball fight was fun. Want to have another? Meet me and Tui at the snow fort. Totally! Snowball fights are so much fun. Veggiezilla! Hi everyone, it's me, Molly. And I'm Trini. Welcome to my garden. Vegetables need sunlight to grow. And in the summer, Alaska gets a lot of sunlight. So our veggies can get really big. Help us grow giant vegetables to eat. Maybe we'll even win prizes at the Alaska State Fair. Cabbage. Here are our cabbage plants. We're going to take care of them so they can grow really big for the fair. If you want to take a break or start over, tap this button. Oh no! The soil in our garden is getting too dry. What can we read to learn how to water our plants? Great job! Nice! This informational blog post can help us learn how to fix our soil. Plants need lots of water. When soil gets dry, gardeners water their gardens with watering cans or hoses. What tools should we use to water our soil? Tap the soil to add water. Awesome! Our soil isn't dry anymore, and our plants are growing. Awesome job!
That's awesome! We are ready for the fair! Let's see how much the cabbage weighs. We did it! Wow! That cabbage is enormous! And we won first place in the Alaska State Fair! I can't wait to share these yummy vegetables with our friends and family! Woohoo! Let's grow some more big vegetables. Tap the button to choose another vegetable. Hi, Mal. Hi, Mom. I'd love some more agate stones. Can you find any more at the river? Yeah, I'm on it. Masi, ciao. Thanks, Molly. How's it going, Molly? Hi, Dad. Can you pick me some fresh blueberries so I can make some more blueberry jam? I'd love to help. Anabasi. Thanks, Molly. How's it going, Molly? Hi, Auntie Midge. More people are asking for my famous syrup. Can you collect more sap for me? Sure thing. Mustn't cho. Thanks, Molly. Let's collect some agate stones to bring to Mom. All done. Here in Alaska, we only take what we need. And we've got five beautiful agate stones. Let's bring the agate stones to Mom. I'll add them to my backpack. This is Mr. Patuk's wood shop. He's not here right now. Let's pick blueberries so Dad can make blueberry jam. All done! Here in Alaska, we only take what we need, and we've got a full basket. Let's bring the blueberries to Dad. I'll add them to my backpack. Let's collect sap to bring to Auntie Midge so she can make her syrup. First, drill a hole in the tree. Next, put the spile, a small tube, into the tree. This is how the sap will flow out. Then, pound the spile in to get it just deep enough to stay in place. Now, hang the bucket to collect the sap. All done! Here in Alaska, we only take what we need. And we've got a full bucket. Mitch, I'll add it to my backpack. How's it going, Mal? Hi, Mom. Did you find any agate stones? Yep, they're in my backpack. Let's get them from my backpack. Wow, thanks for the agates, Molly. I'll polish these up so we can sell them at the trading post. How's it going, Molly? Hi, Dad. Did you find any blueberries? Yep, they're in my backpack. Let's get them from my backpack. Anabasi, thanks for the blueberries, Mal. Now I can make blueberry jam. How's it going, Molly? Hi, Auntie Midge. Did you find any sap for me? Yep, it's in my backpack. Let's get it from my backpack. Thanks, Molly. This app will make delicious syrup we can have with pancakes. That 
That's where Trini is. That's where Tui is. That's where Suki is. That's where Grandpa Nat is. That's where Auntie Midge is. That's where Mom is. That's where Dad is. That's where I am. Tap the basketball to shoot it into the hoop. Woohoo! Great job! Awesome! Yeah! Woohoo! Woohoo! Great job! Yeah! Woohoo! Yeah! Awesome! Great job! Great job! Great job! Great job! Great job! Yeah! This is the greenhouse, where we grow vegetables and other plants. Nobody's in there now. Fish camp. Hey everyone, my dad taught me how to fish for food. Now I'm fishing with Trini and her dad, and I have a book to help us. Which way should we go for a fishing adventure? Let's catch some salmon for a celebration at the Tribal Hall. Here's a book we can use. It's called Alaskan Fishing. Before we can fish, we need a hook on the end of the line. But which one? Tap the book to open it. Hi, I'm here to help you while you play. Try tapping on me right now. Alaskan Fishing by Gil Nett. 
Here's the page of the book that can help us. Let's read the book to help us choose which hook we should use. Fishing hooks. To catch a fish with a fishing rod, the line needs a hook at the end. Some hooks look like food to get the fish to bite it. This is called a lure. Tap the hook with all of the important parts. That's not right. Tap the hook with hooray! You use the caption to choose a hook with the important parts. We're nearly ready to fish. Tap to put on our life jackets. Great job! Let's fish. Let's go fishing. We need three fish. Press and hold the arrows to raise and lower the lure. You can use your keyboard arrow keys too. We caught a salmon! Press and hold the arrow to bring it up to the boat. Hooray! We caught a fish! Only two more to go. We caught a salmon! Press and hold the arrow to bring it up to the boat. Woohoo! We caught another fish. We only need one more. Our hook is caught. Tap the plant to remove it. Oops, let's remove that. We caught a salmon. Press and hold the arrow to bring it up to the boat. Nice fishing. That's all that we need to catch today. We believe that we don't catch the salmon. The salmon give themselves to us. So we take only what we need. This salmon was perfect for our celebration at the tribal hall. Masi Cho, thank you to the salmon. That was fun. Let's keep going. Let's catch some salmon to feed the sled dogs. What kind of salmon should we catch for the dogs to eat? Tap the book to open it. Alaskan Fishing by Gil Neff. Here's the page of the book that can help us. Let's read the book to find out what kind of salmon we should catch to feed the dogs. There are many types of fish to catch in Alaska. Chum salmon can have stripes like a tiger. They are sometimes called dog salmon because they are good to feed to sled dogs. King salmon are large gray and blue fish that often have spots. They are fish that people like to eat and are also called Chinook salmon. Tap the picture of the salmon you would feed to the dogs. That's great! You use the caption to choose the chum salmon to feed to the dogs. We're almost ready to fish. Tap to match everyone with their boots. Great job! Let's fish! This is our fish wheel. It spins around in the water and catches fish in the net. After the net catches fish, the salmon come out of a slide. We need three full troughs of salmon. But which slide will the fish come down? Tap to move the trough to the side where they slide down to catch them. We caught a fish! We need more fish to fill our trough. That trough is full. It's time to fill another. Here's an empty one. That trap is full. Great fishing! That's all that we need to catch today. The dogs love the chum salmon. Masi Cho, thank you to the salmon. That was fun! Let's keep going. Let's catch some salmon for dinner. We like to eat the salmon called Chinook. Which one is that? Tap the book to open it. Alaskan Fishing by Gil Neff. Here's the page of the book that can help us. 
Let's read the book to find out which salmon is called Chinook. There are many types of fish to catch in Alaska. Chum salmon can have stripes like a tiger. They are sometimes called dog salmon because they are good to feed to sled dogs. King salmon are large gray and blue fish that often have spots. They are fish that people like to eat and are also called Chinook salmon. Tap the picture of the Chinook salmon. Good job! You used the caption to find the Chinook salmon. We're not ready to fish yet. Tap to put a snack into our bag. Great job! Let's fish! We caught a salmon! Press and hold the arrow to bring it up to the boat! Hooray! We caught a fish! Only two more to go. We caught a salmon! Press and hold the arrow to bring it up to the boat. Woohoo! We caught another fish. We only need one more. Our hook is caught. Tap the plant to remove it. Uh-oh! Caught again. We caught a salmon! Press and hold the arrow to bring it up to the boat. Great fishing! That's all that we need to catch today. This salmon was delicious. Masi Cho, thank you to the salmon. We finished our fishing adventure. Let's go on another one. Great fishing! We still have more chum salmon. Let's bring some to Tui so he can feed it to his sled dogs. I'll add the fish to my backpack. the fish to Tui. What's up, Molly? Not much. Great day for exploring. I just caught some really big fish. Now I have some extra fish in my backpack that you can feed to your dogs. Let's get it from my backpack. Awesome! My dogs love eating chump salmon. Oyana! That means thanks in the Yupik language. Do you want some treats, Suki? I have some in my backpack. Let's get them from my backpack. Throw the treats to Suki. That's enough treats for Suki. Collect sap to bring to Auntie Midge so she can make her syrup. First, throw a hole in the tree. Next, put the spile, a small tube, into the tree. This is how the sap will flow out. Then, pound the spile in to get it just deep enough to stay in place. Now, hang the bucket to collect the sap. All done! Here in Alaska, we only take what we need, and we've got a full bucket. Let's bring the sap to Auntie Midge. I'll add it to my backpack.
Let's pick blueberries so Dad can make blueberry jam. All done! Here in Alaska, we only take what we need, and we've got a full basket. Let's bring the blueberries to Dad. I'll add them to my backpack. Let's collect some agate stones to bring to Mom. All done! Here in Alaska, we only take what we need. And we've got five beautiful agate stones. Let's bring the agate stones to Mom. I'll add them to my backpack. Hi, Molly. Hi, Auntie Midge. Did you find any sap for me? Yep, it's in my backpack. Let's get it from my backpack. Thanks, Molly. This sap will make delicious syrup we can have with pancakes. How's it going, Molly? Hi, Dad. Did you find any blueberries? Yep, they're in my backpack. Let's get them from my backpack. Anna Bassi, thanks for the blueberries, Mal. Now I can make blueberry jam. Hi, Mal. Hi, Mom. Did you find any agate stones? Yep, they're in my backpack. Let's get them from my backpack. Wow, thanks for the agates, Molly. I'll polish these up so we can sell them at the trading post. Let's have a snowball fight. Tap to throw snowballs at Trini and Tui. And watch out! <laughs> yeah! Incoming! Yeah! Incoming! Woo! <laughs> Look out! <laughs>
The spooky house. It doesn't look like anyone's in there. Spooky. Denali Trading Post. Hey everyone, it's me, Molly. Welcome to the Denali Trading Post. This is a busy store, and Suki and I could really use your help. Let's see who we can help first. Connie is here with a shopping list. You're going dog sledding? We have just what you need. Let's see what's on your list. Gloves. Tap the arrow to find it. Let's find the dog sledding gear. When you find it, tap or drag it into the basket. Gloves. <laughs> Woohoo! We found it! Thanks for stopping by, Connie. This place is hopping today, Suki. Hello, Mr. Patuk. Let's see what's on your list. A stuffed moose and crayons. Tap the arrow to find each thing. Let's find the toys. A stuffed <laughs> moose. Crayons. Yeah, we found everything. Masip Cho. Thanks, Mr. Patuk. Someone else is here with a shopping list. Hi, Jake. Let's see what's on your list. A GPS device and binoculars. Tap the... Let's find the hiking gear. A GPS device. Binoculars. We did it. Have a great day, Jake. Let's put these things away. Drag each one to its empty spot. Now you put the rest away. Awesome! We put everything where it needs to go. Let's take a break and play with Suki. Tap on her ball to throw it. Tap on her stick to play tug of war. The trading post is busy today. Hello, Kenji. Let's see what's on your list. Soap, a toothbrush, and floss. Tap the arrow to find each thing. Let's find what they wanted. A toothbrush. Floss. Soap. Yeah, we found everything. Thanks for stopping by, Kenji. Someone else is here with a shopping list. Hi, Nina. Let's see what's on your list. A backpack, a kettle, and a map. Tap the arrow to find each thing. Let's find the camping gear. A map, a kettle, a backpack. Woohoo! Thanks for stopping by, Nina. The training post is busy today. Hi, Vera. Let's see what's on your list. A hammer, a wrench, and... A screwdriver. Tap the arrow to find each thing. Let's find the tools. A wrench. A hammer. A screwdriver. Yeah! We found everything! Thanks for stopping by, Vera. We have more things to put on the shelves. Good job! We put everything away. Let's play with Suki. Someone else is here with a shopping list. Hello, Atsuk. Let's see what's on your list. A book called Fishing, a tackle box, a net, and a bucket. Tap the arrow to find each thing. Let's find the fishing gear. A book called Fishing. A tackle box. 
A net! A bucket! We did it! Masi Cho! Thanks, Atsuk! The training post is busy today! Hi, Oscar! Let's see what's on your list! Water shoes, towels, a map, and a life jacket. Tap the arrow to find each thing. Let's find the canoeing gear. A life jacket, towels, a map, water shoes. Yeah, we found everything. Thanks for stopping by, Oscar. Someone else is here with a shopping list. Hello, Kenji. Let's see what's on your list. Towels, water shoes, sunscreen, and a map. Tap the arrow to find each thing. Let's find the canoeing gear. Sunscreen, water shoes, a map, towels. Woohoo! Masi Cho! Thanks, Kenji. We have more things to put on the shelves. Oops! We have to match each thing to its spot on the shelf. Awesome! We put everything where it needs to go.